it went a good six, seven minutes past the uh, top of the uh, hour. And uh, in the end, MJF, uh, what happened was, we'll get into all the details in a moment, but they went the full hour. It and was, then uh, 521, I believe. They went the full hour, and the referee announced that it, it was a draw. And because MJF was the champion, it was just a draw. He was retaining. And everyone starts booing, yeah. but nobody left. Yeah. You know, there were boos and bullshit chants, but I think everybody knew that somebody was going to do something. Our AI is going crazy right here. Somebody was going to do something mm -hmm. and uh, ended up with Tony Schiavone getting out of the announced desk. And everybody saw him standing up, so they knew he was going to come out. And he announced it was going to go to sudden death. Tony Khan announced we have to have a winner because the people were chanting bullshit and everything like that, which they expected. And they yep. were cultivating and everything like Not cultivating. They, I mean, I'm sure they didn't want it, but but when they, you know, it set up with it where they were going. Yep. And so MJF, at the end of the 60 minutes, had been had, he was trapped in a hole. He's trying not to submit. He's holding off. And he holds off until the the time limit expires. Yeah. And uh, he actually taps. He taps after he the ta time. He limit. taps like a second after the time limit expires. And so you know, as they're as they're announcing that it's a draw, they get all these medical people in the ring, and you know, Brian Danielson, he's jumping up, he's ready to keep going. At MJF, they put oxygen on him. He yeah. needs oxygen. Yeah, that's that's a good twist. It was it was great. So. You know, then they announce a match must continue, and so Brian's all excited. MJF's covered in blood. He doesn't want, to. and so as they're doing the match, you know, he gets the ring. The ring gets confiscated, and finally, MJF rolls to the floor, and there is the oxygen tank. And as Bryce is trying well, to get did, the didn't, ring, didn't didn't he use the belt? Didn't he try to use the belt first? Well, the he had tried. Well, he used tried to use the. Uh, he was in a hold, and and the ref took the ring off because right, he was trying right, to use the right. ring. But anyway, so as the ref is getting rid of the ring, he sees the oxygen tank, clonks Brian Danielson with the oxygen tank. They end up back in the ring. He puts Danielson in the yes lock. Yeah, the LaBelle Danielson's lock. Danielson's his own finish. And, you know, Danielson, they raise the arm, and Danielson starts to fight back, but then he collapses, and he taps. Yeah. yeah he, he didn't did, go unconscious. He didn't pass out. He, he tapped. tapped out. Yes. And so MGF retained the title, and, man, that was one awesome one hour and seven or five or whatever yeah. Iron Man match. It was the best Iron Man match that's ever had that's ever been, I would say. Um, you know, I mean, it was one of the it was, it was one of the it was an incredible match. By the end of this, I was convinced Iron Mike Sharp is the best wrestler who ever lived. He's low key at first, like, ah, bah, bah, bah. but he keeps going. Bah, ah, bah, 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 he claps. Bah, 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 bah. Yeah, I got a hell of a ass. <laughs> Ah, I'm tall. I'm giant Mike Sharp. If you enjoy these videos, for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full-length editions of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, The Mad Men Podcast, Speak Now Pro Wrestling with Denise Salcedo and more, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.